to you by our exclusive fabric partners. Be sure to look for their newest lines of fabric. Hi, welcome to Quiltmaker's Block Network. I'm Carolyn Bain with Quiltmaker Magazine. Today I'm going to share with you Counterspin. It's block number 666 designed by Carolyn Goines for Quiltmaker's 100 Blocks, Volume 7. This block has 3D triangles that I'm going to show you how to make. To make this block, you need three different fabrics, a background and two contrasting fabrics. You can find the cutting dimensions on the right side of your screen. If you'd like to write these down, please pause your video now. To make this block, you're going to use stitch and flip. We've put a white patch here in the corner of the green patch and sewn a diagonal line from corner to corner. Now you'll trim a quarter inch beyond this outside line and flip your patch open. You do that on all four corners, just like this one, to make a section. And you need four sections like this for the block. To make the 3D triangles, take a rectangle, fold it in half, and then stitch a quarter inch away from the side. Look like this, press the seam open, and then flip the triangle right sides out. There you have a 3D triangle, and you'll need to make four of these. Okay, arrange your sections and your triangles out in four different sections like this. Notice on these triangles that the seam is facing down for all of them. Now you can either pin these in place or base them in place, whatever you choose, and then you'll sew these two together and these two together, and then you'll sew the block together. And here is your finished block. Now notice that the triangles are, are not attached, they're loose. And to adhere these, go ahead and just sew four little buttons like this for to complete your block. Let's look at a couple of quilt designs using this block. The first one has the block set straight with sashes sewn on two sides to offset the blocks. The second layout has the block set on points separated by thin sashes and cornerstones. You can find Counterspin and 99 other creative blocks in Quiltmaker's 100 Blocks Volume 7. Thanks for joining us today on Quiltmaker's Block Network. I hope to see you next time. And sewn a diagonal line from corner to corner. Cor corner to corner.